Buffalo. Buffalo? <laughs> he said buffalo. So slowly I turned and I hit him and I bit him. I rocked him, I socked him and I knocked him to the floor. With a bump and a clump and a lump and a thump, I gave that guy what for. And man, when I was finished, he must have known by then to never, no, never say buffalo again. Oh, I used to have a honey bun, and we were doing fine. Until the day she told me that she loved a friend of mine. I met the guy on Monday, and when he said hello, he said they were eloping on a train to Buffalo. Buffalo! <laughs> he said Buffalo. So slowly I turned, and I hit him, and I bit him, I rocked him, I socked him, and I knocked him to the floor. With a bump and a clump and a lump and a thump, I gave that guy what for. And man, when I was finished, he must must have known by then to never, no, never say buffalo again. I was standing in a tavern when I met a guy I know. We talked a while and then he said, I really have to go. I asked him where you're going and he answered, don't you know, I'm going down to Africa to hunt some buffalo. <laughs> buffalo, <laughs> he said buffalo. So slowly I turned and I hit him and I bit him, I rocked him, I sucked him and I knocked him to the floor. With a bump and a clump and a lump and a thump, I gave that guy what for. And man, when I was finished, he must have known by then to never, no, never say buffalo again. I was standing at a party when a fella caught my eye. I know from what he said he was a braggy kind of guy. He said, I'm quite a lover, a modern Romeo. I'll never be the kind of guy a gal can buffalo. Yeah, yeah, buffalo. <laughs> He said, Buffalo, so slowly I turned and I hit him and I bit him and I rocked him, I sucked him and I knocked him to the floor. With a bump and a clump and a lump and a thump, I gave that guy what for. And man, when I was finished, he must have known by then to never, no, never say Buffalo again. You said Buffalo. Ah!